Hello, I'm Philip Stoughton for ID People. I'm here at ID World in Rio de Janeiro and I'm joined by Alistair Sinclair who's from the Chilean Mint. Yes. Alistair, thanks for stopping by to chat. Some big changes going on at the Chilean Mint in terms of your business model. Tell me a bit about that. Well, um, in 2009 we stopped being a 100% government agency. Um, obviously an agency dedicated for over 300 years printing banknotes and minting coins. Mm -hmm. um, a parallel, a parallel sales channel that we have is passport production, um, driver's license, which in Chile up to now has been paper-based card, you could say. And late last year, the Chilean government commissioned us to propose a new change in the technology, which basically meant, um, you know, upgrading all our our, our plant capacity to a car production plant which we will be using to um, upgrade our, our passport production as well. Okay, so it's like an identity card or a... It's going to be a polycarbonate card, yeah. contactless chip, um, centralized issuance from our plant which is going to be in place in December this year. Okay, that's fast. Yeah. It, was, it was very very fast. They, they literally gave us three months to, okay. to do the implementation. Okay, and you've really had to change, I guess, the infrastructure of the business as well as the infrastructure of your, of your facility to manage that, I guess. Definitely. You know, it's been, it's been a lot of market study, mm. getting to know the business, getting to know the suppliers, um, recognizing who we can, you know, ally ourselves with mm. in terms of presenting ourselves to projects in Chile and outside. Okay. Because now that we are private, we are obviously able to, yeah. Yeah, to yeah. compete. Okay. And I guess that's I, partly why you're here, to look at what's going on in the, in the world in different regions. But particularly in South America, is there anything that you think where you think, yes, that's where we can, um, Definitely. We can fit in as a business? Definitely. Um, my role in the company is sales manager for Africa, Asia and Middle East, basically okay. the non-Spanish non speaking world. Mm -hmm. Um, and I, I'm definitely looking at projects where we can be active, you know, um, associate ourselves with people who are running projects, who are going yeah. to be running projects, and obviously just traveling through the different regions, showing, you know, our capacity, showing what we can offer, and being a small, a small fish in a big pond, mm. you know, basically as we are at the moment. It hasn't been easy and I don't expect it will be either no. in the coming years. No. But I think maybe, I mean, I give myself two to three years until we can, we can make a breakthrough in yeah. some Improve. country in my, yeah. in my <coughs> specific region. Yeah. And in, in, in the home market, you're, what, what stage is that project at? You say it's live in December. How fast do you expect to roll out the cards? Our card production machines have arrived. Um, no, about two weeks ago. Mm -hmm. um, our personal machine should be arriving in October. So, you know, it's just basically expanded our horizon a whole yeah. great deal. And, you know, we just have to now sit down, focus, get our thoughts together where we can, where we can be competitive, how we can be competitive. Okay. And you, but you continue to print banknotes, yes. mint coins yes. for... Um, for the Chilean for the Chilean government, what was the what was the strategy for them behind that kind of privatization? Well, it it turned out to be very positive because when we when we did change into a, into a private company in two thousand and nine, the new board of directors proposed uh, an upgrade to our existing machinery, okay. which involved an investment of ninety million dollars in a new banknote production line which at the mm. time was the most most modern line available in the world. Okay. That's been supplied by, by Switzerland mm -hmm. and was inaugurated late August okay. this year. Okay. So we are, I mean, looking at the future you know, in a yeah. very positive way. Yeah, yeah, and lots of, and lots of opportunities. Well, it Definitely. sounds like exciting times ahead. Thank you very much Thank for you stopping very much by for to talk about it. Thank Pleasure you. to meet you. Thanks, Alistair. Likewise. Thanks.